Cinnamon, a high aspect ratio, check. A low Mohs hardness, check. A great smell, check. But can it be turned? Apparently not. We're going to need some help, so let's cue the epoxy resin. You can spend a lot of time preparing projects and making sure that the resin mold itself is sealed, so when this happens, you find a leak. Don't you just feel like? Oh well, time for plan B. Balance is restored. So onwards with the project. I have to say that the aroma of the cinnamon being released at this stage is awesome, but you just gotta take my word for it, or try it yourself. Right, I've got a joke for you. I've decided that I'm gonna write a stand-up routine about my favorite spice, and I'm gonna call it a cinnamon shtick. Never mind, it's a dad joke. Onwards with the turn.
To save you a lot of time watching the sanding, the sealing, more sanding and the Yorkshire gritting, which is a little like watching the grass grow, we'll skip to the final hollowing sequence. Here's the final piece. The swirl of the cinnamon sticks is absolutely incredible and thankfully having a small amount of resin dye allows for different coloured lights to bring this piece alive to suit your mood. I hope you enjoyed this video, so please hammer that like button, glue your finger to the subscribe button, sand and polish the bell icon for notifications. It would be great if you could leave a comment below and let me know what you think of this project. The format of the video is a bit different than usual, but we've got to try something different once in a while. Thanks for watching and catch you next time.